Okay, I'm gonna do one more thing before I leave. I'm gonna read this poem. Um, it's something I wrote really recently, just actually a couple weeks ago, and it's called The Storm. Outside my window, the wind and rain blows, almost as ferociously as I do at you, causing the stir of the tides like I cause that stir in your eyes. The colors outside swirl like cherry-filled sweet rolls, the way your hair fell through my hands, twisting around my fingers. The rain draws circles on my window like I drew circles on your forehead with the tips of my fingers. The wind pushes itself into the rain the way you pushed yourself into and out of my life. The rain yields to the touch of the wind like I yielded to you both nights we were together with temperamental indifference. The wind sweeps across my window holding on to anything it finds for fear that it will hit the ground and be shattered into a thousand pieces, just like you, afraid that you'll be hurt by the fall and never considering the beauty of the trip. The rain knows it will hit the ground eventually. It only wants to enjoy the ride, like me, knowing I will feel pain, but still fit pursuing what I want so that I get the thrill of the kill. The rain hates the wind's disruption of its path the way I hate you disrupting my life. The rain loves the way the wind makes it beautiful and allows it to catch the light. Like I love you, making you feel beautiful, if only superficially and only for a night. The wind dies down, the rain dries up, we pass each other by, it's too easy to give up. You and I are like the wind and rain in a storm, always in a struggle, a beautiful drama of life, a replenishing cycle of love, a never-ending chance meeting at a coffee shop or somebody's window, waiting to engulf each other in an ultimate mass of confusion. Okay. show number 10, how you doing? Uh, that was uh, Rachel Cryer doing a poem she wrote called um, The Storm. She's going to be coming up in the show in a little while doing a song that she wrote, so make sure you guys hang out. Um, once again, you have uh, hit Days on uh, Days TV. It's the 10th show. It's hard to believe I've been on the air for 10 months straight. Pretty great, guys. Um, always remember, guys, I'm always on at... Uh, 7 o'clock every Monday on uh, TCI, Channel 10, where you're watching right now. And I do uh, one show every month, so it runs four times. So just depends what number this is, I'm not quite sure. Okay, you guys, uh, I got all kinds of stuff coming up this month. Uh, give it a listen, guys. And oh yeah, once again, I dedicate all my shows to Jesus Christ and God, my Savior, the God that makes this all possible. Hang tight, guys. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah. Okay, guys. This goes out to all the ladies. Mm. Okay, guys. Uh, I don't know who that was or what that was all about, but uh, hopefully he didn't offend anyone. But on a more serious note, uh, hope you guys are having a good time watching the show. Um, you know, I'd really like to meet all of you guys out there, all of the artists and poets, all the musicians I can. Um, if you guys want to give me a call at my uh, home phone, I would love you to be on the show. Totally serious. You guys can meet me every Wednesday at 8 o'clock at this little coffee bar. Like I said, guys, I can't uh, give away the name of the uh, coffee place because that would be advertising, and I can't really do that. But if you give me a call, I can let you know exactly where it's at, and we can put you on stage and put you on the show, guys. It's all open form poetry um, and music. You can pretty much do anything you want. It's really neat. Um, up next, you guys, I'm going to have uh, my friend Jeremy do his now famous ketchup song. <laughs> Check it out, guys. We read from our eyes. That's all we can do. Just some cool stuff I read off the book. Humor is always almost. Dude, um, really, when I play music, it's all just. For me, music is just worship. And I worship my creator when I play. So thank you for letting me get up and worship before I do. Catch up, song. Catch up, song. Okay, anyway, 
Up next, we're going to have um, Jimmy, the front man from uh, the group Gemini. Do a little number for you. Check it out, guys. And once again, guys, if you guys want to know where this place is, where we're doing all this performing at, give me a call right here, 225-1917. I'll be sure to pick it up and let you know where you can meet me, guys. Okay, check it out. Um, this next one is called War, another original.
Okay, guys, I uh, hope everyone's having a good time out there. Um, that was Jimmy, the uh, front man from the band Gemini. It's an excellent song that he wrote. Okay, up next, guys, we're going to have uh, a girl named uh, Rachel Cryer. She's the one that did uh, the poem at the beginning of the show. This is a little song that she co-wrote. I'm not sure what the name of it is. I think it's uh, Miss You Like Crazy, something like that. But be sure you check it out, guys. No
Yeah, that was um, Rachel doing that song she wrote. Pretty good song, huh? Yeah, I hope everyone's having a good time. Once again, uh, you caught Days on Days TV. I'm here every Monday at 7 o'clock on the station you were watching. Be sure to look for it, guys. I'm also in the uh, TV Guide, so take a look there, too. Once again, guys, uh, call me at my home right here. It's uh, Days TV at 225-1917. I can uh, let you know where all these artists are performing at. Like I said, guys, I want you guys to come out and play a couple songs for me. Give me a call and I'll let you know uh, where the coffee shop's at. Up next, uh, I'm going to have uh, a mem member of uh, Totally Day is doing a song that she wrote. This song, is, what's the name of the song, Lisa? Feeling. Feeling, yeah. It's a song she wrote called Feeling. like it a lot. Check it out, guys.
uh, that was Lisa Medina doing a song that she wrote that was called Feeling. Damn good song, huh? Okay, that's just about it, guys. Uh, that was show number 10. Like I said, I can't believe I've been going on for 10 months straight. And I uh, thank all you guys for watching. Once again, guys, I want to hear from you. My number is right here. Call me. 225-1917. I'll let you know where you can meet me and uh, we can talk and stuff. Once again, special thanks and dedication to my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, the one who makes this all possible. And uh, like I said, uh, check me out on next month's show, guys. See ya. Thank you.